हेलो ऑल एंड वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल माय नेम इज चंद्रमणि पांडे एंड थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वाचिंग माय अदर वीडियोस इफ यू आर फैमिलियर विद इनट्यून विन 32 एप्लीकेशन डिप्लॉयमेंट बैक एंड प्रोसेस यू प्रोबेबली नो दैट द फर्स्ट स्टेप आफ्टर द इनट्यून मैनेजमेंट एक्सटेंशन इज इंस्टॉल्ड इज टू चेक वेदर अ डिवाइस इज इन एस मोड और नॉट इन दिस वीडियो वी विल एक्सप्लोर व्हाट इज एस मोड इट्स फीचर एंड व्हाट can be done when a machine is in s mode and how to enable s mode in windows 10 or windows 11 enterprise or pro edition so basically windows in s mode is a setting that prioritizes security and performance by allowing only apps from the microsoft store and restricting access to the command line so it may not be for anyone there are several good reasons to run a windows pc in s mode including it is more secure because it only allows app to be installed from the microsoft store it is streamlined to reduce ram and cpu usage and everything a user does it automatically saved to one drive to free up local space when a device is in s mode window lock down for a security and performance so it is much harder to make mistakes or changes settings that could give you a bad experience and while microsoft edge with bing as a search engine it is your only option as a default browser and you can install different browser from the microsoft store let's see how we can enable s mode in windows 11 and now i am on my client machine if i am running winwar command we can see that the device is in windows 11 enterprise evaluation operating system and the version is 24h2 and if we open the cm trace and go to the intune management extension log and search for mode you can see that the log is also saying that device is not in windows as mode or not a uh, 19h2 windows as supported or later built and because this is not in s mode we can open edge we can open google chrome we can open registry we can open cmd we can open event viewer and we can also install any non store application as well as the store application now let's first see how we can enable the s mode in this device so to do this we have to go to the registry and within registry we have to go to the hklm and then we have to go to the system and within system we have to go to the current control set 001 and within that we have to go to the control and within control we have to go to the ci and then here we have to click on the policy and now here we have to change the sku policy required from 0 to 1 and click on save and then close this registry and just reboot the device so let me reboot the device okay before rebooting the device let me show you this device is also enrolled in intune if i go to access work or school and we can see that device is enrolled in intune and we can manage the device using intune let me click on sync and then close this and now i am going to reboot this device okay now my machine is online and if we now run a command winwar now we can see that the addition is showing as windows 11 enterprise evaluation in s mode and if we open any win32 application like firefox and google chrome let me open it we can see that for security and performance this mode of windows only runs the max of verified application same thing we can check for google chrome and if we open the max of edge we can safely use the edge and if you try to open any tool like cm trace we can see the same thing for cm trace as well so let me run a cmd for cmd also it is showing the same thing and if we go to the registry 
same thing for registry also and if we click on the event viewer looks like we can open the event viewer that's great and if we check the intune management extension log let me open the intune management extension log in the notepad and if we search for mode option let me find the mode We can see that in the log it is saying that device supports S or E mode. So in this case we cannot deploy any Win32 application from the Intune. So what we have to do? We have to deploy only the store apps through the Intune and we can download any application from the Microsoft Store. And last thing if you want to open a services, click on the service. Looks like we are also able to open the services. So that's all I want to show you in this video. In the next video, I will show you how we can disable the S mode using Intune. I hope this is an informative video for you. Thank you very much for watching this video.